This is Crystal Feng with MedPage Today. I'm here in San Francisco at the American Society of Hypertension meeting, where researchers have reported that the ambulatory blood pressure findings from the accomplished trial support the overall results that a calcium channel blocker plus NACE inhibitor may have some pleiotropic benefits for cardiovascular risk compared with a diuretic and ACE inhibitor. Kenneth Jamerson from the University of Michigan reported these findings at a press conference here. We thought that if you put mechanisms together that really has synergy, you get better outcomes. <coughs> we didn't think a diuretic really would help a coronary vessel that was blocked. Uh, to the contrary, amlodipine, to some extent, vasodilates and increases nitric oxide. And if you're a blocked coronary vessel, you're going to get more perfusion. So we were using that kind of mechanistic approach to put together a combination we thought would be superior. We enrolled a large number of people, and it turned out that that strategy uh, was accurate. So you would call that a, play, a more pleiotropic effect or something beyond just lowering blood pressure. And again, the importance of this report is that as best and as accurately as we can measure blood pressure, we did, and we still find that, um, if anything, the diuretic was better, slightly better at lowering blood pressure, but there's still a benefit to the, the combination of amlodipine and plasma. If these findings that the drugs are identical and blood pressure profile supports our original in interpretation of the parent trial, and that is the difference between amlodipine and nasopril providing 20% superiority is actually driven by the effective combination therapy and not by differences in blood pressure. So this type of data has a potential to change paradigms for treating blood pressure from those being more diuretic based in combination therapy to being um, those with uh, amlodipine um, and benazepril type regimens. And again, huge implications for the millions of patients that are taking blood pressure medication um, for increased benefit and importantly, increased blood pressure control. There are lots of healthcare providers and experts who think that just getting the blood pressure down is the most important thing to do. That's what's so unique and important about this message because it's the first trial to show you that it really does matter. Certain combinations give you an advantage over others. And in this particular case, the combination of the calcium channel blocker with a drug that blocks the and angiotensin system reduces stroke, heart attack, and cardiovascular death compared to what we're telling our society to use, and that's a diuretic-based regimen. So it's almost a real paradigm shift. It's a, a hugely important message that no, it really does matter what agent you use. So based on these findings, the researchers concluded that it may not be a matter of just how low the blood pressure gets on antihypertensive medication. It may matter what combination of agents are used. Here in San Francisco at the American Society of Hypertension meeting, I'm Crystal Fend, MedPage Today.